Um, but uh, for the panel, um, we have a lot of discussion about old growth timber. And, you know, uh, what is the average age of a Doug fir tree? And I'm not talking about the oldest one. I'm talking about when the tree actually really just stops producing. And it may sit there for 100 years and produce nothing, but it just, what would that age be? Well, it's a, you know, the, it, it's such a complicated question because fire controls the age of our forest more than anything else. Uh, so, you know, uh, we get trees older than say two or 300 years, only in isolated spots where fire wasn't able to, to get to them because the return interval on fires is, is quicker than that. And it also depends, well it depends on everything, the site quality, how good is the soil, how deep is the soil, what's the elevation, um, but, you know, when, for me as a forester, when I see a, a stand of Douglas fir on a good site around 200 years old, it takes your breath away. I mean, <laughs> you just, wow, that is a vibrant uh, forest. It's probably slowed down in, in its growth, but if it's still healthy, uh, it's, it's something to see. As you get older than that, the forest starts to fall apart, really, and uh, it might have a lot of value for, for certain types of ecosystems and, and certain types of wildlife habitat and, and things like that. But, you know, decline starts in above, say, 200, 250 years where the forest is actually coming apart. And it depends on the site. On a really high quality site, uh, you wouldn't see that as much. But we talk of, I mean, Douglas fir will live to seven, eight hundred years old if it can be protected from fire and it's on a good site. But, uh, but these stands are not, you don't look at them like, wow, that's a real stand of timber. You know, it, it looks more like a, a mixed, mixed level and, and mixed forest.